Konnichiwa, everybody. It's Ward, and it's time for some more Black Mirror. It's been a long time since I watched the last episode, but now I'm finally getting around to it. And now that a new episode or movie came out, interactive movie, Netflix is doing that now, huh? Uh, anyways, I'll do a countdown. Three, two, one, go. Alright, it's working. Yeah, the season has been quite enjoyable so far. And surely there's a new one coming soonish this year. Metalhead. Well, I mean, aside from episode two, uh, episode two was by far my least favorite in the whole show, right? Is that The Rock? I oh, know, that's Idris Elba. I love, love him. No, never mind. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> it's not him. Uh huh. Sounds like fun enough. Being able to look up each other's asses. It's not going to be any color this episode. Oh, we got some tilt shift camera going on. Somebody's living here. He's dying. Is it a dangerous looting mission? Everything is so empty and desolate. Are they like zombies or what? I mean, it looks past apocalyptic enough, especially that car. What is it that they're looking for?
So is this a horror movie or what? <laughs> Alright, there's some technology. Hacking into the car or whatever. Why is he in such a hurry, but they are not? There's something there. Spooky music, yo. Yeah. Looking for a special crate. Why do I have to be so quiet anyway? There's like nobody around. It's gotta be monsters, right? Or what the fuck? That scared shit out of me. <laughs> but it's just like a robot that kills people with splinters or whatever. Damn, the robot dog, uh, run, run, bitch, run. I don't think you stand a chance, dude. No. Nah. Damn. Amazon really got advanced tech, yo. <laughs> Protecting their storage. Uh, get out of there, dude. Damn, it's fast. It's not that scary, though. Scary looking, you know? The bees are scarier. Damn. <laughs> Took a while to get up. Damn. Oh, don't stop now. Just keep driving. Pretty advanced robot, huh? I guess they've taken over the world, or whatever. Cyberdyne. Yeah, I know, he's gone. Oh, he can drive the car. <laughs> that was crazy, yeah. Uh... I couldn't even see anything. I mean, the car didn't look that advanced. Or whatever. Like, uh, self-driving cars, don't they have, like, a bunch of, uh, you know, sensors or whatever? And it's doing pretty advanced stuff, this car. Oh, bad time to get knocked out. 
<laughs> Kill a robot dog on the loose. Oh, didn't they show like a robot dog in uh, some previous episode ish? I'm sure they did. Or she's at the very end, the very edge of the cliff. Oh, here comes the gun. <laughs> Damn, slow motion and everything. Kind of feels like a. Uh, a short movie type of feel. Quite special for a Black Mirror episode, huh? And I could get straight into the action and um, it's really out there. Black Mirror tends to be, you know, set in the real world. Or something that's much more relatable than this ish. All right. The robot stuck. Lost its leg. It's a bit like the Predator uh, vision. Oh, she did get the belt or something stuck in her leg, huh? Man, don't show me some disgusting shit. <laughs> Alright, this wasn't too bad. Did you get it? No, she needs a better tool. She's saving it for later? For what? Oh, that's like a tracking chip. Maybe. Oh, I do love my thrillers. Alien and Terminator and The Thing. My favorite movies, essentially. Oh, she can still be tracked, huh? I wonder how many people are out there and they're getting an item to help save their dad or something. Oh, yeah, of course, if you're just following that, uh, that chip, huh? Uh, 
Oh, damn. Maybe it's the robot. Tony Clark and Bella. Like medicine? Yeah, I would still keep moving. Can't see how that she stopped for such a long time right after encountering it. Graham, is that her son? Oh. Best gotta move on. Quite see it. Oh, there, there it is. Yeah. <laughs> Don't stop. Oh yeah, can it climb trees? I guess not. Didn't look like it would be able to, but it could shoot. Uh, don't know how accurate the gun is. Maybe it doesn't look up first. Damn. Uh -huh. Oh, maybe it can jump real high. Uh -huh. It's a pretty smart robot, isn't it? Does it understand what she's saying? I think it can outweigh her. Right, she needs food and shit. I'll just sit there and wait. Don't fall down. <laughs> what a situation.
should maybe tie yourself to a tree somehow, if at all possible. Oh, just a false warning. Do you want a snack, little guy? It's trying to like waste all of its energy. I think you're depleting yourself as well. Which one will last longer? Oh, it went down one. You have to do that two more times. As in... Until it offers batteries to please them. I mean, you can just take a nap and then do it as well. Take a nap, draw a walk, take a nap. Oh, is this like machine learning? Did it? Is it pretending now? You should pretend to fall down, maybe. Because it can't really see unless it stands up. Uh, now run. Legged mate, <laughs> yeah. It's still alive, of course. Uh, right? Hmm. Gotta keep that suspense up by not showing it. Get up. There's an interesting looking fence in the middle of the forest. Maybe it puts itself into like an advanced sleep. Oh, it was recharging. Like solar energy. It's going very fast. I guess it doesn't take a lot of electricity, but that doesn't really make sense. I mean, I guess it is the future. That is a good enough explanation. Range Rover. Does somebody live here? Gotta get those keys. Who leaves their keys behind in the apocalypse, huh? I mean, isn't there a window you could break into? It's going to be just in the nick of time, huh? Man, you could get, get, get a bit of anxiety watching this. <laughs> Oh, you're going to have to get in. The car keys might be inside, I guess. Also, you'd be safer. Oh, 
hurry up. Try off the keys. Might want to lock that door. That's a nice home. Are you going to see it through the window? She got an idea. Is she going to try and kill it? What is that? Shotgun shells? Well, hurry up. Don't walk so casual, eh? Man, a rich person lived here for sure. Got all grand piano. Guitar, art. Oh, she feels at home. Is there going to be some color back in her life? I have missed this. Can't reminisce for too long. I guess this could also be the episode with the least dialogue, uh, if this keeps up, I guess. I don't really see her getting out of this situation, but... Oh, damn. I mean, you'd smell it from pretty far away if they're that intact, right? Oh yeah, that's a shotgun you need, huh? You need to grab it from him. Him and his lover. Ah, oh, surprise is so intact, that pose. Crap visceral. Yeah, the whole house would reek, surely. And the car keys. I mean, if you could run away, you should have just tried at the very least, instead of just blowing your brains out. This girl seems to have survived long enough. A woman. Two shots, one shot. Do not miss your chance to blow. Is that really the first dead person or whatever she came across? Surprised she's freaking out that much uh, and survived this long. Because there's like nobody else around. Oh, there's time for a jump scare. Right. I feel like th that's going to be one coming again. <laughs> Freaking jump scares, man. Oh, we could see it actually. Never mind. No, I don't feel scared anymore. Are you just going to hack your way in? <laughs> like R2-D2? R2-D2? Probably the first one to do that, right? A robot that hacks? By sticking its probe into some sockets? Oh, 
Well, I mean, surely her prints wouldn't stick out inside of that place, right? Is it that advanced, that robot? Because there's, there's like gravel there and shit. Uh, it's not like. Was she bleeding all over the place? Maybe she was. And I guess it can detect life even without her footprints ish. Do they have painkillers? You're making a lot of noise. Are you gonna see it in a reflection? Oh, it was about to leave. Don't tell me that. Oh, it's gonna head up the stairs. Oh wait, aren't they on the same floor? <laughs> it's grabbing a knife. <laughs> <laughs> that is ridiculous. I thought it still was able to shoot. Just gotta test it out first. <laughs> oh, you just heard the sound. <laughs> Who will win the gun or the knife? It's a battle of the ages. Man versus machine. Does feel a little bit like an old horror movie, I guess. <laughs> oh, this is a great shot again. What? Don't lose track of it. Either just shoot it or don't. Do one or the other. Like run away. Like get the fuck out of there. Because you had a great opportunity to shoot it right now. This is... <laughs> She's just hiding. Waiting until this thing blows over. Will it give up? <laughs> this is ridiculous, y'all. Killer dog. Paint. Oh. Is he gonna stab Violet? Oh yeah, it shouldn't be able to walk down there so easily either. If it can't see, right? Oh, I think I played this music before. In Black Mirror. Where does that music come from? <laughs> Oh, you had enough stabbing now? Range Rover. Is she gonna blow up the car? What? Oh, the speakers. <laughs> oh, now who's being hunted, huh? <laughs> Fire another one. Huh? This is crazy. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> is that gonna do it? I think she had something stuck in her teeth. Of course, you don't have time to worry about that. 
either a killer, dog, robots, on the loose. Self-destruct mode. Trackers. Backup is coming. You can see it's blinking. There's too many. You could get those out, right? Oh, she's gonna do it. It's gonna be painful though. She's gonna blow her brains out. She's gonna give up now. Oh, there's one at her throat though. No, but if it got in there so easily, you could get it out still, right? Without killing herself. I'm destined to be like this forever now. I guess it just embeds itself perfectly in your skin. I think it's a bit ridiculous though. She tried. But she failed. Also, it's a bit confusing. Why would they track you instead of just outright kill you? Like, why aren't there more? Why don't they have more lethal shots instead of a bunch of tracking devices? That doesn't make a lot of sense, really. She's gonna actually just kill herself without even trying to take it out? What? That's pretty dumb. And also, you got a gun. You have some more bullets, don't you? Probably better to do it with shotgun. Giving up without a fight now after it came this far? That's pretty ridiculous. Alright, there are a bunch of more dogs coming. The world is run by robot dogs for some reason. Is there some famous classic musical piece? Did you see what was in that box? Is that where we're going? Oh yeah, that is where we're going. What? They came there just for some teddy bears? Really? I don't... I don't get it. <laughs> there was a sick child. What a weird episode. Not my favorite by a long shot. But it's uh, way better than that uh, freaking uh, 
uh, what's her name? Jane Foster? No, uh, Jodie Foster episode. Episode 2 of this season. That one was terrible. Uh, huh. Metalhead. I've already forgotten it. <laughs> Almost. <laughs> Even though I kind of love this sort of stalker, slasher movies. Um, Halloween, the first Halloween. Which that reminded me a lot of, um, especially with the shotgun. And like a sort of invincible killer, right? Uh, who just keeps getting up. And who's kind of alien. Right. And some of the shots as well. Uh, not knowing where the enemy is. But also getting to see it a lot, walking in the distance or whatever. Because in the Halloween, um, I mean, you should, you should watch Halloween if you haven't. It's a really, really great movie. Also one of my favorites. Uh, but yeah, I love those movies. But this one, this episode, uh, did not do it for me, really. I guess it's mostly because the enemy was so ridiculous. Killer robot dog. Really? <laughs> I mean, it was a bit spooky when I, you know, they gave me a jump scare at the beginning, but... They could, they didn't even give it, like, a menacing look, it's just... It's kind of plain looking. Right? I mean, I, that is how the robot dogs look today. Uh, you, I've seen it on Reddit, of course, so... Right, I guess they could have. Was that actually not entirely CG? Maybe. I wonder how they did it. Because, I mean, it looked pretty real, right? Good CG looks pretty good today, right? At least that is an impressive aspect, if anything. Uh, but yeah, surely I feel like I missed something uh, about. Finding a special box with a bunch of teddy bear stuffed animal for Jack. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I'm lost. Anyways, that's it for this episode, but I'll see you guys next time, alright? Don't forget to subscribe if you enjoyed my reaction, and there's early access available on Patreon. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.